I'm Steve Simpson, Emergency Management Officer for Manatee County Emergency Management. Let's talk a little bit about uh, Charlie coming in. You can see how Charlie came in and went into the bay and went this way. And it was a very tight 10 mile wide uh, hurricane without very much surge built up. But let's talk about the surge. When you look through Collier, Lee, Charlotte, and Sarasota counties, you will notice there's very little areas that are not subject to surge inundation. What does that mean for Manatee County? What that means is that these places are going to have to evacuate. Where are those people going to go? They're either going to go to Miami or they're going to come up this way. And you're talking 1.6 million people. And we always, when we talk about uh, evacuation scenarios, we always have to look at it regionally, which means that we are going to be subject to taking care of some of those people. And so that's going to be a huge issue for us, not only for our shelters and sheltering our own people, but sheltering people from other areas. Hello, my name is Don Hermy. I am the Chief of Emergency Management for Manatee County, and I'm here today to talk to you about our evacuation zones and what all this modeling is within Manatee County. We're color-coded for evacuation A through E. Evacuation A zones is if we're expecting a storm surge of up to about six feet. Evacuation E is if we're expecting storm surge upwards of 28 feet, and all the color codes are associated in between that. When we do order an evacuation, if it's a level E evacuation, we're actually asking approximately 220,000 people to leave their home. The other component with this map is it's not just about storm surge. It can also be about flooding, sheet flooding. So it's not just a coastal event. If you notice to the east part of our county, we have a lot of blue. This is where we anticipate if there's heavy torrential downpours, lots of rain, uh, four or five inches of rain an hour, this is where we can expect a lot of the pooling of all that water since if we have a storm surge coming in, this water has nowhere to go. So we will expect to see some flooding to our East County. It's not just a coastal event. I'm Karen Winden, Deputy County Administrator. During Hurricane Charlie, I was the Public Safety Director at the time, and uh, that was a very uh, difficult situation to be in. I think what struck me most about that was the uh, dichotomy of a storm heading towards us with its eyes on the crosshairs of Manatee County, but also looking around the Emergency Operations Center and seeing the level of engagement and preparedness and passion that the, the people that were involved in that situation had for our community and for making sure that, that we came out strong.